Hey, Red Lewis here again. Welcome back to my channel. And on this video, I'll show you guys how to source products from the Home Depot.com to sell on your Amazon FBA business, right? And for a start, I want to invite you guys again to join my free VIP Amazon group where I do my free weekly Amazon coaching calls. And also, this is a good place for Amazon sellers like you to network with other sellers. So, yeah, with that said, this is how you guys search or, or source products from the Home Depot, right? So obviously the first step is to go to um, homedepot.com and then you guys are going to pick, sorry, your first is, so pick some random products, right, on, on the Home Depot or homedepot.com. And then, so for example, this one, right, this one is, is a Stanley Home Toolkit. So I would search this product on Amazon. So Stanley Home Toolkit. Which I think is this one. Let's see. It is, right? Looks like it. Hmm. Okay, looks like it. And then from here, you um, run your numbers, right? So this one is fifty-seven ninety-two from the Home Depot. Man, it's taking a while to load. Okay, it's right there. So fifty-seven ninety-two, right? You plug in your cost here on selling amp seven ninety-two, and then you you um, run your numbers. So this product is giving you a 24% ROI. Sales per month is 120. And then from here, you look at the other sellers and see if you're okay to share the sales with these other sellers, right? So ask your question, are you okay with, with sharing 120 sales with these other sellers, right? So based on the ratio, it looks good. And then here, I want to see how, how the Keepa chart is looking. Um, I mean, this product was selling at a very low price before, at $54. But recently, it's been selling all the way up to like $95. So this makes it risky, honestly. But based on the recent sellers on this listing, seems like they're selling this between $82 like, and $97. So if you price it somewhere here, right, at at least $80, $80 you're going to be making at least a 10% ROI, right, on this product. So I think this is good. It just depends on your risk tolerance on this product or on this data, I mean. So, yeah, there's one. And from there, you move on to the next product. So again, pick another uh, random product. It's right there. Post this. And then let's go to the home page again on Amazon. And then here. Copy this. Search on Amazon. And then from here, you look for the exact product, which I think is this one. Let's see. This one is 74 bucks. Well, first let's check if it's the same product, right? So 17 inch, 18 pocket. This is an 18 pocket. Man, this is number of compartments is six. Um, let's see here. Just more information, let's see. not really seeing but let's look at the photo and see
I mean, to me, it looks the same. So from here, I would run the numbers. So this one is, how much is this? 44.98 is the price. And the selling price on Amazon is 75, so it's negative. Yeah, this one's negative, unless you want to price it up here, or I mean, down here, right? Which I don't recommend because ideally, like you want to be up here, so you can get the sales as quickly as possible. So this one, I mean, we found the product from the Home Depot, right? Which is a point of video. Unfortunately, we just can't sell this because of the data. So there's that, and let's keep it moving. So we go check the next product. Try this one. So again, copy this. Search. Um, wait, what? Wait a second. Sorry, guys. I copied the wrong. It didn't work, so. Okay. Right here. Let's see if we can find it. So it's a Husky, right? Husky 650. I'm not seeing Husky here, though. Let's see if we can photo. Okay. Yeah, I'm not seeing Husky here. Okay, it's not here, so skip it. Let's keep it moving. Next product. Okay, searches on Amazon. Hopefully you find it. Yeah, it's not here either. So Milwaukee 475, right? Milwaukee 600. Yeah, it's not here either. Yeah, but I hope you guys got value from the video anyway. Um, this is how you guys look for products from the Home Depot, right? So start with going at or going to Home Depot.com and then pick products from Home Depot. And then from here, right? So for, for example, this one, you pick it and it starts your product on Amazon. And then once you find it, you run your numbers and hopefully the numbers add up so you can sell their product on Amazon. And with that said, I hope you guys have value from the video. And I'm going to post my free VIP Amazon group below if you guys haven't joined or joined it. So it's at that group. I do my weekly calls and also it's a good place for you to network with other sellers. I'm going to put the link in the description below and I hope you guys join it and I'll see you guys on my next one. Bye-bye.